Sunday and welcome back to another CVS haul video for today. All right, so these deals are good from today, May the 5th until May 11. Okay, so actually it is the second week of deals. We had the same ad since last week and this week. I did do posted, I think one transaction or like Sunday haul. I actually went back um middle of the week but i didn't have a chance to film my cvs haul video anyways some of those items that i grab is actually the same thing with i'm gonna share with you today all right um coupon wise i did receive two uh ten dollar off 70 flash coupons so those coupons i did use in both of my transactions i did utilize two different cvs card one card have 25 dollar in extra bucks and that's only the card I have extra bucks with. <laughs> and in the other card, I got zero, nada, bankrupt, no extra bucks. So I did have a little bit out of pocket. Not a little bit. Actually, high out of pocket on my second transaction. Um, I have a few gift card, a CVS gift card. I have one, two, three, four gift cards, you guys. And I did pay the remaining with my um, debit card. Let's go ahead and talk about the deals. The first deal I got here is the You Buy Kotex. So I am trying to stock up with feminine care or feminine items. I don't have a lot on my stockpile. Um, I think the reason is we don't get a lot of deals with these. So I did pick up one of the 40 count panel liners. This is Price at $5.99 in my store, but it did ring up half off at $2.99. And then I pick up this teen order thin pads, 12 count. This is priced at $6.99 in my store. They are a promotion for buy one, get one half off. So this is full price at $6.99. This is half off at $2.99. So then when you buy two, you will earn $2 in extra bucks. So here's the math. For both of these, total is $9.98. We do have a dollar digital coupon that works on any of these. I paid $8.98, receive $2 extra bucks, and then $1 on Ibotta for the liner, as well as $1 for the uh, pads. So final cost for both of these is $4.98 or just $2.49 a piece. That is before the $10 off at $70. So yeah, I know my haul for both transactions today, I have cost. Um, the thing is, I did grab things that I actually be needing, using, or reselling. So I don't really grab things, random things, just because. <laughs> Alright, the next thing I got is the Dove Hand Soap. Dove Hand Soap are buy two, get three dollar in extra bucks. They are priced at $5.49. So for both of these, your total will be $10.98. If your store is cheaper, adjust your math accordingly. We have a $3.99 digital coupon. You're going to pay $6.99. Receive $3 extra bucks for buying two. Final cost for both of these is $3.99 or just $2. So the Nivea deal is spend $20. You get $10 in extra bucks. All right. So I got two of the $9.99. So the first one is the Coco butter nine dollars and 99 cents i thought this raised price like crazy and this is the 72 hours which my mom's favorite this is also nine dollars and 99 cents i'll buy two your store must follow the 98 percent rule to get the ten dollar extra back so for both of these your total is 19 dollars and 98 cents we do have a two dollar digital coupon if you have inserts, I know we do have a $4 of two inserts and a $2 up to you if you want to use those. So I don't purchase inserts. I It's been a long time, the, the last time I purchased an insert. So I do print my coupons and just use digital coupon. So I did printed these $2 from coupons.com. Guess you guys, it is not scanning. And my store won't push coupon. I missed a two dollar savings but i did submit my receipt on shop Meum for a two dollar cashback so it's still even out anyways your um 
Final cost after the two dollar digital coupon is seventeen ninety eight. Receive a ten dollar extra box and two dollar from Shop Me. Final cost is five ninety eight, or just two dollars and seventy nine cents a piece. So under three dollar for me is still a good deal for the lotion. All right, so the L'Oreal product is spend thirty get ten. So here's what I pick up. Um, the wipes is seven dollars and seventy nine cents in my store, and this is the current sunscreen moisturizer that I do use, the Revitalift Bright Reveal with glycolic acid. Um, this is priced at twenty three dollars and ninety nine cents. All right, so for both of these, total is thirty one dollars and seventy eight cents. We do have a $3 digital coupon that works for these. There is no coupon for these. But we do have a $5 CRT for L'Oreal product. And then for my card, when I scan these, there is a $5 off to CRT that's attaching for these. For like facial care product or a sun care product, that CRT is not coming off at all. And my store, like what I said, they will not push any coupon for me and i did shop at my petty store today so i already know what to expect so then i paid a total of 23 dollars and 78 cents for both of these receive 10 dollar extra back so final cost for both of these is 13 dollars and 78 cents or six dollars and 89 cents a piece i know that's a lot but it is what it is <laughs> but if you have a five dollar off 25 l'oreal crt this will be cheaper like eight dollars and 78 cents for both or four dollar and 39 cents a piece so i think it's still a good deal because i do use this and like what i said i only buy things now that i do utilize so that i will not waste money all right so that's all i have for this receipt I'm going to clip a photo of my receipt on the screen. So the top one is the You Buy Kotex. Buy one, get one half off. And then we have the Dove hand soap. Then the L'Oreal. And then this is the towelette. And then the Nivea lotion. Another Nivea lotion. And then the last thing in there is the L'Oreal Revitalift moisturizer for $23.99. My total for all eight products is $72.72 so then the $10 off 70 will apply for the coupons I have the $3.99 Dove hand soap a $3 digital coupon for the L'Oreal Paris moisturizer $2 for the Nivea lotion a dollar for the Kotex and like what I said I was supposed to use these but it didn't come off um Ten dollar off seventy five dollar L'Oreal facial care CRT, um, a three dollar off acne skincare. I forgot to factor that one in on my L'Oreal breakdown. Anyways, I will just cor correct. I always correct myself when I edit my videos. So then, um, I did roll twenty five dollars in extra bucks. My subtotal was $19.18. That's how much I paid. But I did roll everything with uh, my gift card. So I don't have any out-of-pocket like real cash with this transaction. And then I got back a total of $25 in extra bucks. $10 for the L'Oreal. $2 for the You Buy Kotex. $10 for the Nivea Lotion. As well as $3 for Dove hand soap. And then I did receive $2 on Ibotta for $1 for the Ubi Kotex pads and $1 for the Ubi Kotex liner. As well as $2 for Shop Mium for the Nivea that I don't have a coupon. So here's the final breakdown. I did roll $25 in extra bucks. I paid out of pocket subtotal $19.18. That is a total of $44.18 cost. I did receive $25 in extra bucks. $2 from Ibotta and then $2 from Shopmail, making everything a final cost of $15.18. So if the $5 off to um, facial care product came off, everything should only be $10.18, which I would be happy. <laughs> but next transaction, um, the new video, I did the deal again. And then for this, for this card, um we also like what i said this is a different card so i did use the two dollar digital coupon and then for the other one i did submit it on alexa for the second one since the two dollar digital or 
printable coupon is not coming off so i did submitted my other receipt on alexa and yes, yeah, so the breakdown is almost the same because I did also utilize a $10 off 70. So it's like $2.99 after coupons and rebates. All right, um, for this receipt, I have a couple of issues. So the first one is the Nivea printable net scanning. And then the second one, which I'm about to share with you, I was hoping a double dip with this Dove Bar Soap. This is my first time buying these. So I'm excited to try. But now since this receipt has a lot of costs, I uh, might return one or two of these to get just the money back. So anyways, um, the Dove Bar Soap. So I got the coconut milk and sugar lychee. The oat milk and berry brulee and then i got the turmeric milk and lemon drop so let me know which is your favorite if you have tried these let me know which one is your favorite scent i heard um the turmeric one smells good so i don't pick this one up there is also a purple one which is macadamia and something that is not too aromatic for me for my opinion this is the best scent for me if you ask me the turmeric and the lemon drop anyways they are eight dollars and 29 cents in my store for a freaking bar soap eight dollars <laughs> that's insane so i when you buy two of these this week you can also grab a male bar soap if you um interested to buy a, another guy uh bar soap for a 29 they're about the same price so these will total you 24 dollars and 87 cents for all three of them we do have a two dollar digital coupon off one and there is a five dollar off three digital coupon i will i thought really that will glitch with this um that five dollar off three then came off on my receipt so that's a big mop mop right there but then um if that work out for you if the five dollar off three comes off you are paying 17 dollars and 87 cents receive five dollar extra bucks for buying two and then a six dollar on ibotta you get two dollar cash back on each so that's a limit three your final cost for both for all three of it this is only six dollars and 87 cents or just two dollars and 29 cents a bar so if you were able to double dip the ma the manufacturer digital coupons but for me since the five dollar didn't come off my final cost for all three was eight eleven dollars and 87 cents or three dollar and 95 cents a piece that for me is way too high four bucks for these is it's way too high for me so then um i might return a couple of these maybe i'll just get the turmeric one i will return both of these just because this is a lot out of pocket in my opinion if that five dollar of tick came off i think i would have to get them but yeah it's just too much too much for my blood okay the last deal or a couple more deals that i did which helped me a little bit to lower my out of pocket is the cover girl so the cover girl is buy two get five dollar extra bucks these are priced at five dollars and 79 cents in my store total 11.58 i did use a three dollar printable coupon from coupons.com or shop Meal. this can perfectly fine we have a three dollar digital coupon as well as well as a four dollar instant coupon for covergirl so after all those coupon that is ten dollars off you will pay a dollar fifty eight receive five dollar extra bucks and making both of these a free plus three dollars and forty two cents money maker all right so a couple more deals um they are not really deals but i did receive a weekend warrior where i redeem 15 offers i will earn a five dollar in a bonus so that i am counting on that to have a little bit lower out of pocket with these transactions um so i did what i did again last saturday sunday which i pick up five of the cvs toothbrushes so i found these at the trial seven trial section at a dollar 19 and we do have 20 cents rebate on ibotta on each of this 
this already gave me like five dollar rebate towards that bonus so i picked this one up anyway so for five of these at a dollar 19 total 5.95 you will receive a dollar on ibotta 20 cents times five making these like 4.95 before bonus items i have here are the dental flosses again these are the cvs brand they are buy one get one 40 percent off and these are priced at two dollars and 89 cents in my store and the second one will ring up at a dollar 73 so i grabbed four just because i'm gonna get that i bought a bonus so then all four of these came out to 924 I did get back 25 cents on each on Ibotta. That is also limit five. And yes, I did hit my um, weekend warrior. So I did receive $5 for all my Ibotta rebate. And I will factor that in in this transaction. All right, so that's all I have in this receipt. I'm going to discuss what was my issue in this uh, receipt when I get there. Okay. So the top one is the CVS Dental Floss. I got four of that for buy one get one 40% off at $2.89. The CoverGirl Pencil, two of those are $5.79. We got the Dove Bar Soap, $8.29, $8.29, and an $8.29. And you can see like that's those are the highest paid item that I have out of pocket for. And then two Nivea at $9.99. PS toothbrushes, five of those at $1.19. Okay, let's go down to the coupons. And this is the least coupon I have so far in most of my transactions that I did. There's only like one, two, three, four, five, six coupons six coupons for a 70 dollar worth of product this is crazy all right so let's talk about these the three dollar manufacturer coupon is the cover girl three dollar digital coupon for cover girl two dollar for dove which is the bar soap so i am missing the five dollar off three dove bar soap um i'm not sure why it did not come off probably try grabbing all the same scents who knows like i couldn't figure out why it's not coming off but then um i know we can rely on glitches sometimes but it has been working with other people like what i saw on youtube but anyways uh two dollar nivea lotion there and this one i did check out with a regular cashier so i didn't really pay attention of what coupons come off if i do use self-checkout then that's the time i really look on what coupons comes off so i can like modify something or like void a transaction and rework my products but i just let it go anyways ten dollar off 17 your next purchase and then four dollars crt for the cover girl and then i paid a subtotal of 47.61 so yeah like what i said this coupons i'm technically missing seven dollar worth five dollar for the dub and two dollar for the nevia anyways um it should be only $40.61. But I did receive $20 in extra box. My extra box got cut because she ran out of receipt. So I got the five there and in the bottom is nothing. And then when she replaced the receipt, she put it the wrong way. So that means whatever I have left over will not print. Anyways, um, it showed on my app. So I got back $5 for the cover girl for buying two, $10 for spending 20 on the Nivea, and then $5 for buying two of the Dove Bar Soap. So I got back 20 as well as $8 on Ibotta. So that is $1 for the CVS toothbrush one dollar for the cvs floss and then six dollars for the dove bar soap that is two dollar times three so i did get eight dollars back as well as five dollar weekend wire bonus for uh, redeeming 15 offers and then two dollar on alexa hopefully for the nivea lotion that i did submit it already so then here's the final math um I paid subtotal of $47.61. So making after the extra bucks, $28 I bought a $5 I bought a bonus and $2 Alexa rebate. Everything comes out to be $12.61 cost. 
All right, so if I am about to return, I am thinking to return. I'm going to keep the Nivea because those are my jam. But I am going to return to you the bar soap, which is $6.94 and $6.93. So it's going to balance out my auto pocket with this transaction because that's about $12. So that's how I am I going to resolve the coupons issue not coming off. I never call customer service for any missing coupons or missing CRT, like the $5 off too for the L'Oreal. I never bother because I, it's like for me calling CVS customer service is literally wasting your time. So that's all I have for you with my CVS haul. Let me know if you have any questions down below. I have parked outside my house, so there's a lot of shenanigans going on outside. So that's why you, you see my eyes is everywhere. <laughs> but you guys, thank you so much for watching. I am about to film my Walgreens haul video. I actually enjoyed Walgreens, shopping Walgreens today and then CVS. So let me go grab my Walgreens stuff. It's in the house. I came home. Um, I unload my stuff. I park in the garage. I unload my stuff because it's you guys it's hot already here in, in LA so um, Now my plan is since also our gas is freaking five dollars a gallon and whenever before whenever I shop So how I do it is I shop at CVS finish shopping. I film right away in the car so filming apparently it takes me like 30 to 45 minutes max is an hour actually but like with editing i can chop like one fourth of just me talking so anyways um yeah so i did came home and load my stuff look for my receipt did a quick breakdown so you see me i have like a little paper of breakdowns so then i this video will be long and uh, not long and then but me uh, here i am talking so it's longer but yeah so that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna finish all shopping because when i turn on my car use my ac like it's the, the gas the gas y'all is gassing like it just disappear so that's all i have for you today at cvs thank you so so much for watching if you like this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you are new here thank you so much for subscribing um i always use digital coupons when i coupon i don't buy inserts if you're new here i don't utilize inserts so you will not see me mention any of that in this video unless i have printable coupons or peelies that i found in the store i will mention that but anyway thanks again and i will see you in the next one bye bye